Today, Friday the 28th of July, 2017 at Thornbury Theatre, the Consulate General of Nepal to Victoria and the entire Nepal Consulate Office team are honoured to host a most special guest on her first official visit to Victoria, Ambassador Extraordinary and Plenipotentiary of Nepal to Australia, Her Excellency Lucky Sherpa. Ms Sherpa was appointed Ambassador Designate to Australia by President Bidya Devi Bandari on the recommendation of the Council of Ministers in accordance with Article 282-1 of the Constitution of Nepal on Thursday the 18th of May this year. Ms Sherpa officially commenced her work after presenting her credentials to His Excellency General, the Honourable Sir Peter Cosgrove Governor General in Canberra, Australia on Tuesday the 27th of June. It is with delight and pride that we have with us today the first Indigenous female Ambassador of Nepal and that we have the opportunity today to present to you a brief biography. Ms Sherpa has always enjoyed family life, happily married to Mr Nwong Sonam Sherpa and also proud mother to two sons, Tashi Jungle and Ang Furi Sherpa. The young Ms Sherpa was always independent growing up, encouraged by her parents to achieve academically in search of a fulfilling and enriching career. Ms Sherpa proudly recalls her sister and her growing up in a family respected as sons, with their father encouraging them to live their lives with full dignity and with the hopes of growing up to become true leaders of society. Backed by the encouragement and confidence of her parents, Ms Sherpa was determined to make her family proud. Ms Sherpa went on to top her class in 2001 at Parton campus at Trihulban University, becoming the first female graduate from the Sherpa community to hold a master's degree in economics. Ms Sherpa was an elected member of the Constituent Assembly and Parliament of Nepal and was a legislative member of the International Relations and Human Rights Committee under the Legislative Parliament. Ms Sherpa has participated in training provided by the International Labour Organisation, the United National Development Programme, as well as a most recent program organised at Harvard University by the US Embassy in Nepal at the Karana Centre for Peace Building in Washington DC. Ms Sherpa has led the Parliamentarians Network on the environment that is Globe Nepal a member organisation of Globe International and is also an International Steering Committee member of the Climate Vulnerable Countries Network. Ms Sherpa has been an advisor for networks and organisations dedicated to upstanding causes such as the promotion of green development, inclusive democracy, human rights and the rule of law. Ms Sherpa was honoured with the recognition of Youth Ambassador for Peace in 2007, Young Women Human Rights Leader by the World Youth Federation for Peace in Korea, and by MADRE, an international women's human rights organisation in the United States of America. Ms Sherpa went on to become the first Sherpa to reach Politburo level in the party politics of Nepal, and made history when she was the first Indigenous woman appointed as Ambassador of the Government of Nepal. Her father, Shaim Sunda Shepa, former associate professor at Tripuvan University in Kathmandu, who said that his daughter was the most suitable person for the ambassadorial role, given her proven track record in working with various interest groups. As the first female Nepalese ambassador to Australia, Ms Sherpa is set to serve three terms with a clear manifesto and with confidence in her vision for the next four years. Ms Sherpa's first call to action was to update the Embassy of Nepal's website, an action aimed at facilitating the Embassy's mission in representing and in serving Australia's Nepalese community. We are proud and we are honoured to welcome to Melbourne a woman whose passions for economic empowerment, biological diversity, the environment and human rights have taken her to the front lines of many national and international organisations. We look forward to working with Her Excellency towards strengthening the relationship of Nepal and Australia. The Nepal Consulate Office wishes you every success in creating your vision through commitment as Ambassador. Your tenure will see Australia's Nepalese community benefit through the promotion of Nepalese culture, tourism, as well as trade and development. We wish you well in your time as Ambassador in Australia and the Nepal Consulate Office is ready to wholeheartedly support your vision and ventures. What a wonderful personality. We now have new Nepalese Ambassador to Australia, Her Excellency Lucky Sherpa, very highly talented, smart and beautiful personality. We all are very, very proud to have you as our new Ambassador. On behalf of 
Nepalese community living in Victoria, our community organizations, the leaders, and my consulate team would like to wish you all the best during your tenure and welcome to Melbourne and we all welcome you in Victoria.